Aloha and welcome to JSA TV, where we're covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from the leaders in global connectivity, real estate, and the networks within. I'm Buffy Harakitis of JSA, and joining me today is Sam Rabinowitz. He is the CEO of Lantana LED. Sam, welcome. Thank you so much for having me, Buffy. Yeah, so it's so great to be here in Hawaii for PTC 24, <laughs> uh, the biggest PTC to date. Ooh. And why don't you tell viewers a little bit about what has been the most exciting part of the conference for you so far? Totally, totally. That's a great question. So for me, PTC really sets the tone for the year. It's the first major data center conference for the year. And what we've consistently seen across the board here already is just excitement and yeah. expansion. You know, for us, we're meeting with customers, with new potential customers, and across the board, what we're seeing is some plans that were, you know, six, 12 months old are doubling in size, tripling in size. We're seeing customers who are just doing retrofits suddenly now starting to do new builds as well. So really capturing that momentum, that excitement that was building at the end of 2023, as well as over the past couple of years, actually, and really driving that forward into 2024. For me, that's setting this tone. That's what is going to be for us in 2024. That's really driving this industry is just this insatiable demand and the excitement to supply it as well. Absolutely. And you guys have a space right here on the PTC Hub floor. Some fun activations going on, yeah. a photo booth. So <laughs> if you are yeah. here at PTC, be sure to stop by the Lantana LED booth. And Lantana LED is focused on lighting yes. um, within data centers. And uh, why don't you give us some background on that and what trends you see ahead as far as data centers go in 2024? Totally, totally. You know, lighting is often an afterthought for mm -hmm. data centers. But what I like to remind our customers, what I like to remind the consultative engineers, architects that we work with, is really that lighting is still an essential component. You know, it's still part of your ability to get a certificate of occupancy. It's still part of the fire life safety systems of the data center because you need lighting in order to operate it safely. You know, so that that is a something that we remind our data center customers about and really talk to them. You know, listen, I know lighting is not the first thing that somebody thinks about when they think right. of how to design or build a data center. But because it's that essential component, it's still something that needs its own deliberate thought and really, you know, given the time and space to plan for it in these data center designs, which are so minutely and carefully planned out each time. So for me, you know, looking ahead in 2024, three of the major data center trends that I see is just the continuation of the past six months of the generative AI, AI ML, and really driving data centers into this new incredible space. What does that mean for lighting? You know, when I think about that, that really is talking about flexibility. That's talking about higher heat levels because of the GPUs running at higher temperatures. So we need to plan flexibility into products. We need to plan flexibility into designs of data centers as well. That's uh, trend number one that I see. Uh, trend number two is really, again, somewhat related to AIML, but still focusing on automation and data centers. You know, really driving home the efforts and the the work that has been done over the past 10 years of driving into building automation. You know, that could be at a fixture level, that's occupancy sensors, that's daylight harvesting sensors, that at a BMS level, a building management system level, that's, you know, operating different systems across the building, all as from a single source, all from a single platform. Uh, and then from, you know, from the overall broader view, that's driving this AI technology, and there's some great companies out there working on this, but that's driving this AI technology into these building automation systems. So that's number two. And then finally, number three, you know, is what I like to talk about. It's, it's a little bit of a misnomer. Um, it's this idea that there is a lights out data center, which as a lighting company is kind of funny. Um, that's not something that you'd think about from a lighting right. company. But a lights out data center really is a misnomer because it doesn't mean that there are no lights in a data center. It means that they are utilizing that automation. automation yeah. Exactly. Exactly. So we've been hearing lights out data center for yeah. several years now. Yes. 
So are you saying that we're going to hear more and more about it, or are there actually going to be more lights out data centers as we continue on in this year? I'm hoping both. Okay. I'm hoping both uh, because even though you know, even though we're still selling lights into data centers, we want to see the most efficient data centers. Right. We want to drive towards energy efficiency in data centers, and that building automation, those sensors, those controls that allow lights to go off in a data center once the occupancy has diminished down to zero, that's essential. So I'm hoping that not only will we hear more about this, but we will actually see more of this as well more lights out data center deployments. Exactly. Right. But with lights. With but lights. with lights. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's, just, it's the actual concept of lights out data center. Yeah. It yeah. doesn't mean that the lights are actually off. It's just the way of creating more efficiency within the data center. Exactly. Yeah. Well, great insights uh, for <laughs> sure. And I know that 2024 is definitely going to be an exciting year for Lantana. Oh, yeah. And there's, you mentioned products yes. uh, in some of your trends that you were discussing. So why don't you tell viewers a little bit more about the products that you have coming in 2024? Absolutely. Buffy, thank you. That's awesome. I love talking about this because 2023 for us was a huge product development year. We brought eight new products to market. Uh, and we now have three entire families, suites of products that are really geared towards delivering to our customers, to our channel partners, and then also directly towards our sales partners and our actual sales contacts in the data center space itself. So for us, we break these down into three separate families. Okay. First and foremost, there is the Lucent family of products, and that's our, really our, based on our original fixture lines. And it's very distinctive, stylish illumination that's really geared towards that architectural space. So think office, general commercial spaces, but also really human-centric areas. And the Lucent line is also where we bring in the latest technology from circadian rhythm. So really focused on human-centric bio lighting. So really focusing on health, the health and wellness and what's called well-building standards. Uh, then we have our edge linear fixtures and our edge suite of families, uh, suite of products. And that's really focused on our industrial as well as our mission critical data center infrastructure uh, projects. So that is, w we took a step back and we took a look at all of the specifications that we've seen, all of the projects that we've done, and we developed a suite of products that provides pretty much the entire interior lighting package for a data center and does so with the most energy efficiency mm -hmm. and does so with the most sustainability in mind and does so with the most recycled products in mind as much as possible and really provides that full suite of products for our data center customers. Finally, we have a really exciting new family of products called the Neoteric suite of uh, the Neoteric family of products. Uh, think Neoteric, that's for us, this is sleek, modern, slim fixtures that are really geared towards those, again, human areas, that architectural market, okay. really that provides a stylish view of lighting and a minimalist view of lighting as well. So some great lines, some sharp angles that really are very exciting. Wow. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> lighting never sounds so sleek before. <laughs> what a great way. Uh, Thank you. Great way to uh, explain those product lines. Yeah. Um, is there anything else that you wanted to add about those product lines or about any trends for 2024 today? Absolutely. So one of the other things that we're so excited about, uh, our incredible marketing team uh, has done a fantastic job. And as of this morning, actually, as of today, our fantastic new website is up and we are able, uh, our customers are able to go to the website and download specifications for all of these new families of products, as well as see these new products in scenes, some of them installed already. So that's really exciting and a huge kudos out to our fantastic marketing team for that huge effort. Uh, so that's that to me is really exciting. You know, again, we're really thrilled by 2024 and the expansion that we're seeing and just the growth in our own business, as well as in this incredible dynamic market that we're in right now. Absolutely. So you mentioned that new website. Yes. And those three dynamic product lines of yep. lighting. So where can people go if they want to 
Yes. Great yeah. question. Yeah. So uh, head on over to www.lantanaled.com uh, and come check us out. Uh, and we look forward to seeing everybody either here at PTC or in the future at the other uh, trade shows that we'll be at, as well as just seeing you and communicating with you uh, as we speak to you directly and over the phone. And in just a few short months, uh, we'll be releasing our Greener Data Volume yes. 2. And you will be featured as one of the authors there as well. Yes. Yeah, yes. I'm very so exciting excited. exciting year for Lantana. Yes. An exciting <laughs> year here at PTC24. Thank you so much, Sam, for joining us today. And for our viewers at home, stay curious, stay connected, and happy networking. Mahalo.